Uh, we are gonna hike into a den site and confirm whether or not this pack has reproduced. So we're gonna look for a pup scat. We're gonna try to get an estimate on the number of wolves. So we got a wolf track and see the four toes, a little bit of a claw mark, and then this would be the pad. North central Montana is a distinctive area characterized by diverse landscapes ranging from the Rocky Mountains to flatlands, providing an excellent habitat for various animals, including wolves. Yeah, my toes are a little numb after that. We, so we got out a collar on this pack last year. So that's how I was able to find this like den site, rendezvous site area because they started localizing in this spot. A wolf rendezvous site is where a wolf pack moves its pups after they are weaned, but still too young to travel with the adults. Right here is a good example of some pup scat. So seeing this now, we know that these wolves did reproduce and that there is a breeding pair in this pack. And you can see there's like multiple entrances and exits. One of our main goals as wolf specialists is to get a count on how many wolves are in the state through population monitoring. So we need to go out and verify packs as biologists. And then once we verify where a pack is, we're gonna try to get at least a, a minimum count on those wolves. Biologists will verify wolf packs by using collar data, collaborating with the public and landowners, utilizing game cameras, and spending a significant amount of time out in the field. I'm, I'm out in the field, I mean, I would say like 80% of the time. Monitoring wolves and assessing their presence is crucial for balancing their populations on the landscape particularly in reducing conflicts with landowners. To accomplish this, biologists must cultivate strong communication skills to engage the public and landowners, promoting collaboration and understanding. Being a biologist, it's you are working with wildlife and you are working on whether it's conservation, uh, research, but a lot of it also involves people Especially in my job, I work a lot on private land, so it's really important to me to be transparent and finding common ground. Because wolves, they are a, a controversial species, and people, whatever side they're on, they can have quite strong emotions either way, and I really enjoy talking with those folks and letting them know what I do and build like a mutual trust. The monitoring of wolves is ongoing and will be for the foreseeable future. For more information on wolves, visit fwp.mt.gov.